Hi everybody. Um, today I'm going to talk about right now um, related angles. Okay, this is for part of uh, trigonometry here. Uh, so how I'd like to bring it up is basically refresh you with something very simple that everybody remembers or should remember is that uh, in math we can have a shape and we can imagine there's a mirror there and flip it over and you know move that or we could you know we could rotate it around so that it might look like that rotation or a flip or whatever, or it can look like this. Assume these are all versions of the same triangle, what we really have to remember, which is not rocket science at all, is that if, uh, if this side is A length, that side will be A length, that side will be A length, that side will be A length. It doesn't matter what orientation we draw the triangle, we can draw it like, oh geez, we can draw it like that. There's our A length. Similarly, B, 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 and then of course hypotenuse we use the letter C, right? Piece of cake here, nothing, nothing out of the ordinary here, okay? So these look, look like to be like related triangles, it's, it's, there's a reason for that, it's because of the ratios, because these sides are the same here, the ratios from one side to the next in, uh, in one triangle will be the same in all the triangles. Uh, now, how does this relate to trigonometry? Uh, watch now. I'll show you the magic. Boom. Okay. So, if we take something, well, let's let's divide our uh, let's divide our chart into pi six. Okay. We'll talk about the unit circle since it's something I think we've talked about already. Here, let me just see here. Um, well, anyway, regardless, if we have pi six, that means that Pi distance is divided into six parts here. Okay, so there's one, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, each for 180 degrees, so that means each side is going to be 30 degrees. Yeah, so 30, 30, all the way across. Each one of these is 30. Um, so what? Well, this is one six pi, two six, three six, four six, five six pi. Okay, you'll see that each of these creates a 30 degree triangle, okay? So what I have here are related angles. Because the shape they make right here, it's a, it's a 90, a 30, and a 60 here, okay? Come uh, here, and, oh, I can't draw right now. Anyway, because these are uh, related triangles here, what that means is that these angles, 5 6 pi and 1 6 pi, are related angles. Not only that, if I keep going here, right, so this would be 7 6 pi, it also makes a triangle that is similar to that triangle. Um, this one wouldn't here, but uh, this one here, 11, whoops. 11 6 pi. This one would also, if I would have drawn it right, you could see better. We'll make a related triangle here. So one, two, three, four triangles like that. Therefore, our four related angles here in radiant measures are these four angles. What they've done is they've made four triangles. Similarly, we can look at uh, using uh, I better just clean this up to help illustrate the point. Um, if we just use uh, pi thirds as our, our division here. So we're going to divide it into three parts here. Okay, so that's one third, one third pi, two third pi, then three, three third pi. Okay, so that's, that's uh, 180 divided into three sections of 60 degrees each. So there's another triangle there. So what this tells us is that because these, this triangle here and this triangle here would simply have the same ratios, even though the triangle is just in a different orientation, what it means is that this uh, measurement and this measurement, these are related angles. And of course, going down again, uh, 4 thirds pi, 
5 thirds pi. This also makes another 60 degrees, so it's just the same triangle, different way of looking at it. Again, same triangle, different way of looking at it. So, uh, all these circles, I did something wrong here. No, nope, no, nope, one, two, yeah, okay. All these different four angle measurements here are all related angles, okay? So if that doesn't get the point across about what a related angle is, you know, same triangle, just a different way of looking at it, like flipped or rotated, flipped or whatever, then uh, send me an email and I'll happily go over it with you one more time.